Hey there, so I'm standing on the porch at sunset on a rainy day. You see there's a neighbor over there. There's our parking area. This is the front yard. Whoops, get my finger out of there. This is the front yard. It does slope down. It's kind of a drop off right here. It goes down and then it's sloping there. Some level here. <clears throat> our front porch, front of the house. It looks to be like a masonite type siding, as it said in the in the MLS. Um, you can see through the trees right there is the gravel road that comes to the property. And then we come over here, and here's our side yard. Okay, so where the dirt is, it kind of slopes here a little bit, but it's flat where the green is. So that's the side yard and then a hill going up a little bit there. I'm not sure if the property goes beyond that little hill, but where the trees start there, it kind of gets more gentle. This is the window on the front porch to the larger of the two bedrooms. These are the two windows for the living room area and that's bedroom window for the other bedroom. Hence why they call it a bedroom window, right? So these are um, vinyl tiles here. So we walk in, I'm going to show you, I'm going to take you to the main area and then I'll take you to the master. And I did take dimensions, that door goes out to your back porch, your covered back porch. Um, here's our kitchen. looks in pretty good shape. I'll give you room dimensions. They are right here, so I will show that to you. And one being the larger of the two, which will be, when you come in the front door, it's the bedroom on the right. Um, the only thing I saw with the flooring, where did I see it? Oh, it's in the bedroom, okay. So here is the um, laundry room. So it's got a separate laundry room with a water heater. Um, I was looking for a date to see if we had a date on the water heater. Uh, off the top of my head, I don't see a date, but it may be there. Um, looks pretty new. It's got everything it needs to have. So, um, so it's electric dryer. There's our front door. Here we're going into the larger of the two bedrooms. So there's our front window. Yeah, we'll get over the corner here so you can try and see some of this room better. Um, goes into bathroom with a shower tub. And then there's a walk-in closet in here. So that's kind of nice. It's got a walk-in. The other bedroom does not have a walk-in. Actually, I'll turn off the lights later. Um, so there you go. Okay, and then we're going back out to the great room, or the living room, kitchen, dining, back door, laundry, over in that corner. Okay, and I'm walking across, and coming into bedroom number two, which is a little bit smaller. It does not have a walk-in, just has a regular closet, but it does have its own bathroom. Um, so I guess guests would come in here too. Um, there you go. The only thing I had seen, and I forgot to point it out while we were in there, was in the, there's a couple little scrapes. You can see it on the floor there. There's a little scrape there. Um, I don't think it's a big deal, especially considering these are vinyl tiles. You could probably pull it up and, and replace it. But there was a spot also that I noticed in the master right here. There's a, I don't know if they had a bed. You can see a few spots. Looks like wear spots on there. Um, yeah, it's coming up. So, um, other than that, I really didn't see anything more. Um, so that's basically it. Let me, don't make this video too long or it's gonna be huge. Let's go out the back porch real quick. So here's the back porch. It's screened, which is nice. There's your vent for your uh, dryer vent. Um, I 
the hillside there. And then this goes back out to the parking area over here. So, um, yep, that's basically it. I'll see you later. Bye.